We go from the forest to the beach. Yeah. Quite the change in uh, environment here. Check out this sweet rock someone left. It looks just like what we saw this morning. The fly uh, something. Don't eat it. Do not eat. Unless you really know how to microdose yourself. Ruby Beach. See that right there? That's where the creek comes into the ocean. It's a good place to die right there. It looks like a good place to get real fouled up. That's where you don't want to mess around and find out. No kayaks. No kayaking. See the river right there? It's a good place to make a mistake. Oh look, these guys are going to throw a stick in there to see what happens to it. Do a little practicing on some bodyboarding right there maybe. Welcome to the danger zone. Where's the GoPro? I got it right here. You wouldn't know that we're about to be going on a beach based on where this thing starts. We're headed to the third coast to go surfing. Third coast. I forgot my surfboard though. Yeah, we can borrow one. Oh, maybe. Okay. Yeah, beautiful weather. You can't tell, it looks like dark night under here, but 60 degrees, sunny, very little wind. So it's looking very good. So we did five miles this morning back from five mile camp, five mile island camp in the Ho Rainforest. And we went and saw Ruby Beach briefly. And now we're about to see Third Beach, the Olympic National Park. It's got some diversity to it. We found our first banana slug. It's not moving too fast. No. There he goes. Had to come all the way to the beach to get a slug. Oh, there he goes. It's moving fast now. It's on the move. Good times. 60 degrees in the shade, almost a little chilly. It's perfect. Super quiet in this dense forest. We're gonna hear the ocean. Yeah. Sun's getting lower kind of cool beaming in Third coast is towards the down left you can hear it
coast. Love it. Why don't you tell us about the campsite here? Well, here we got uh, my tent right here. It's drying out a little bit from last night's thunderstorm. The wind's coming in this way, so you got your tent right there. Nice. And tonight, right our there. second attempt at a fire is going to be right uh, south of us. So that way, we don't get smoke in our tents. Good idea. Let's we'll see if we can actually do it this time. Sounds like a good plan. Any uh, challenges of uh, setting up a tent on the beach? Nope. Just got to use Other rocks. Other than bugs. Rocks. Use rocks. Bugs and sand, two things you don't want inside your tent. Yeah, I agree. I don't think I got either in mine right now. It's not super fine sand either. It's kind of uh, extra high Horse. grit. Yeah. But it is sticky. Stick on your feet. Should be all right. Here's our view though. It's not bad. Very nice view. I think I'm gonna start uh, attempting at the fire. Sounds good. Let's see what you got. All right. Let's see. Stop, drop, and roll. Putting fire gel on your chest and stuff? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this fire is, we got these grizzly fire starters, and then we proceeded to squirt fire gel all over them like a cupcake, right? Yeah. They're basically making a bomb. <laughs> Pretty much. We'll see what happens. Looky there. Definitely the biggest fire we've had so far. Yeah. Looks like you got it going. Got a lot more airflow this time with that wind coming in. It's kind of nice. A little bit drier wood as well. Yeah. Oh yeah. Fire gel. Got all kinds of good ingredients for this fire. And you're extra motivated since we couldn't get one the other day. So. Don't want all y'all saying that pyro can't start a fire. So I decided to walk down the beach. See Russell smoke way down there. Decided to come see what this is about. That's really cool rocks and driftwood. There's a passage, up, like a up and around passage right over there. Apparently you cannot pass this if you're doing the trails. Even during low tide, which I can certainly see why. It's pretty treacherous. Really cool, big driftwood logs, big rocks. Take it all the way to the end over here and see if there's a picture. Sand is more like little pebbles. A little bit difficult to walk on. Imagine with a backpack.
pretty nice little stretch of beach. Got some good pictures down there by the rocks. We'll walk about half a mile back to our campsite area. See how Russell's doing with the fire. Just thought we would want to see that. That was pretty, pretty impressive. Even with the tide out. Lots of wave activity, a lot of cool stuff. Well, having dinner when I got back. <laughs> Breakfast and dinner of champions. But look Jesus. at that. Cash is H-E-B Mixed nuts Look at that fire Look at that fire What do you know about going. that? It's a beautiful little scene here This massive driftwood Got a big old Peninsula out there Where the sun set over it a minute ago Very quiet beach Pretty much everybody left Now it's just us and the fire and the sound of the waves our last night of camping out here on third beach Russell's fire done well still going strong gonna have a nice easy night the tents are just right there try to get up tomorrow before that tide comes in got a nice little beach fire here mm-hmm Most successful fire I've seen around these parts. It's pretty hard to beat. We're the only one on this beach with a fire. We're the only ones on this beach. Yeah. <laughs> Best fire on the beach. Yeah.